In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can change the theme of your Arduino IDE. So for example, you can have this nice dark theme. And let's start and I'm going to explain everything step by step. So first, so you have the default theme, okay, for the Arduino, which is that one. Now, one thing I'm going to show you, and that is important, is that some of the tutorials you might find on the internet, okay, for uh, exactly the same thing, which is changing the theme, will explain to you that you have to go to your program files, Arduino, so where the Arduino ID is installed, and then you have a lib folder, and in that lib folder, you have a theme folder. And some people are going to tell you that you have to modify this, but actually don't do that, okay? If you remove that, uh, you're going to remove the main theme, okay? And so in general, it's quite a bad practice to modify directly uh, the software in the program files directory. So we are going to go instead, I'm going to close that. You're going to open sketch, show sketch folder. So you can click on this. This is going to open. So I've created a new sketch here. This is going to open the uh, sketch folder and you can go back just one folder. And you have here the Arduino folder in your documents, okay? That should be uh, around here. And this is where you have all your different uh, sketches or programs. You also have the library folder. And here you are going to create a new, so I'm going to create a new folder named theme. So T-H-E-M-E, -E, all lowercase. And this is where you are going to add any other theme you want to add to your Arduino IDE. And this is not going to mess up with the IDE. This is not going to mess up with the default theme, okay? So as a best practice, create a theme here in your Arduino folder. And now, of course, this is empty. And we are going to add our first theme. And so you can go on uh, internet, on Google, first type uh, dark Arduino theme and go to GitHub you will find this dark Arduino theme that we are going to use as an example, okay? So then you can replicate the instructions for any theme you want. So what's important to get if you want the theme to work in your Arduino IDE is that, so you're going to click on that theme. You need to have a folder which contains at least a syntax folder, like here, which contains a theme.txt, like this, and then a bunch of uh, images, so that can be PNG or whatever, okay? So that's important, syntax folder, theme.txt, and some images. That's what we are going to need. So now I'm going to go back here and download, so I can go to code here, and download zip file, okay? Let's download this. Okay, and once the uh, zip file is downloaded, so what you can do, I'm going here to extract uh, here, so let's extract with, I have seven zip, okay, use any extractor you want. I'm going to extract uh, here, okay, and so I have a folder, and actually the thing is that you will need to put a zip file inside your theme folder, the theme folder you have created, but if you just put this zip file like this, it's not going to work, okay? you need a very specific folder organization. So what you can do, uh, go inside the uh, dark Arduino theme slash master or whatever, and then go to the theme here. And this is what you need, okay? So if you remember the syntax folder, theme.txt and a bunch of images. So you can select everything here, right click, and then I'm going to use 7-zip also, add to theme.zip, okay? It's going to create theme.zip and I'm going to rename this. So rename, let's say, dark Arduino theme. So I can give any name I want here. It's not that uh, important. I just give the same name as it was uh, first on GitHub. That's basically going to be the name you will see on the Arduino ID, but you can change the name if you want. So now I have an archive, a zip archive with directly, okay, so on that archive, I have directly uh, the files, okay, with the theme.txt. I don't have any other folder in between, okay? I'm going to right-click and uh, cut, and I'm going to go to my theme folder, so document Arduino theme, and I'm going to paste the folder here, dark Arduino theme.zip. 
And now I can go to File, Preferences, and here you will see, so you have a whole bunch of options and you have theme and I have the default theme and dark Arduino theme from that zip file. So I click on that, I can click on OK and now I need to restart the Arduino ID. So that's what I'm going to do. And now you can see we have the dark theme. Great. So to recap here, you need to first, so you can download whatever theme you find on the internet and then you are going maybe uh, for most of the cases you need to reorganize the theme okay so on document arduino you create a theme folder and inside you can add any uh, name for the uh, themes you want dot zip and inside directly syntax theme and the images okay and when you want to change the theme in your arduino ide remember that when you change it you need to restart the arduino ide so that the changes can be effective now I'm going back to internet and well, the question now is uh, where can you find the theme for Arduino? Unfortunately, as for now, there is no uh, kind of uh, global repository with all themes. Okay, you are just going to need to search on Google. So you can just search for Arduino theme, Arduino dark theme or whatever you want. Here, for example, this is a page you can uh, easily find. Uh, you have the URL here. That's one page I basically found just by typing Arduino uh, IDE theme, okay? And I have the dark Arduino theme here and etc, etc. So if you want a theme, you can just search on this or on Google. This is actually the theme I showed you, okay, in the introduction of the video. So you can click here. Usually you will get to a GitHub page or you can just get a zip file, okay? As you can see here, it's kind of the same, we have a theme folder and then syntax theme.txt bunch of images. So I'm going to uh, just install that one also, download zip. All right, and now I have my one dark Arduino uh, zip folder. So the thing is that if I just copy this and paste it uh, into the theme here, it's not going to work. Okay, I'm just going to show you that copy paste here on the Arduino theme. If I go to my Arduino IDE file preferences and I don't have the one uh, dark Arduino theme. Okay. So what I need to do, I'm going to remove this uh, here. Okay. I'm going to close first the Arduino IDE. Try again. Okay. And what I'm going to do, I'm going also to extract here. So that's the same thing. Uh, extract files, let's say extract here, you go here, you go to whatever folder you need to find this, syntax, theme.txt and bunch of images. Right click, I'm going to add to theme and let's rename it my uh, theme. I just rename my theme because you can name it as you want. I just put this inside the theme folder of the Arduino IDE. I go back to Arduino, File, Preferences, Theme, and I can choose my theme here. OK, I restart again. And I have the one dark theme. Great. And at any time also, I can do Preferences and I can come back to the default theme. OK, just restarting once more. And now I have the default theme. Great, so that's how you can add as many themes as you want to your Arduino IDE. If you liked this video, subscribe to get more tutorials like this in the future. Also, check out my online courses so you can learn Arduino step by step in an efficient way by practicing and directly going to the point. Links in the description. Alright, thank you for watching. See you in the next tutorial or in one of my courses.